Hi, my name is David Emerson. I'm a long-term multiple myeloma survivor and myeloma cancer coach. Welcome to the vlog post regarding both a myeloma symptom and a myeloma side effect, a therapy for both symptoms and side effects, but an evidence-based non-toxic therapy, a simple vitamin D3. First and foremost, there are now a series of blog posts on people beating cancer outlining both myeloma symptoms and myeloma side effects or side effects from toxic therapies that are standard of care for myeloma patients. For years I've been um, researching supplements, nutrition, lifestyle therapies that um, are designed to heal uh, either are cytotoxic to myeloma, or perhaps are integrative with myeloma therapies, or perhaps can, can heal um, kidney damage. It occurred to me that uh, there are the most common health issues with myeloma are also as a result of side effects of therapies, but also can be symptoms so to find non-toxic therapies that address four, five of the most common side effects and symptoms would be of value to myeloma patients and survivors. Vitamin D is just one of those. In fact, it's probably the most inexpensive, the easiest to take of all uh, non-toxic therapies. To be specific, um, it helps, uh, vitamin D supplementation helps bone health, heart health, kidney function, kidney health, um, and immune function, immune health. Our blood takes a hit when we undergo therapies, especially an autologous stem cell transplant. So, vitamin D supplementation. Personally, I take... Um, small uh, capsules, um, 1,000, um, that's at least 25 or 50 milligrams um, twice a day. Everyone's different. The key is to figure out your serum um, levels of vitamin D3. So supplementation, good, good for all the common side effects and symptoms of myeloma patients, bone, kidney, blood, bone marrow, uh, and heart health. Vitamin D3, good stuff. If you have any questions, comments, scroll down the page, ask me a question. I will reply to you ASAP. Thank you for your time.